You've got to get a hold of yourself. And now, live from New Island, it's the ENN Introductory News with your host, Ben Anker. Good evening. Tonight's top stories. War, disease, famine. Eradicated thanks to new wonder drug, experts are calling opium. And great news for the elderly as questionable social attitudes from the past make a comeback. More on those later, but first, to business. Competition in New Ireland's bustling short-distance courier trade looks set to intensify. Since arriving from the idyllic streets of Brooklyn, East Coast couriers have dominated the bicycle messenger market. However, that dominance is now being challenged by a disruptive startup called Wallaby Wheelers. This ragtag band of former baristas, social science graduates and casual contractors have been financed by Australian retail mogul Bruce Crook. Mr. Crook, known for his passionate campaigning to see more low-skilled labour jobs made available to tweens, spoke earlier today of how his team of enterprising, self-employed freelance messengers favoured the benefits of his company's flexible working over the job security, stable salary and basic workplace rights less cool jobs offer. People want flexibility when they work. Yeah, Wallaby Wheelers, our freelance, self-employed entrepreneurs, enjoy the ability to decide when and for how long they work every day. If a freelancer operating under a service contract agreement with us decides they can afford not to work that day, I'm not going to force them. If they feel they don't need to get paid that day, I'll, well, <laughs> I say, good on you, mate. I'm happy for you. I'll just find some other bludger who isn't afraid of a little hard graft. You crack on. What do I care? In fact, this just in, we're receiving reports that Mr. Crook will oversee a fresh messenger recruitment drive immediately after this broadcast. We'll have more on this story as it develops, but now we're going to cross over to Carol for the latest weather. Carol? I'll show you the ropes. Can't have you tripping through the streets until you learn the basics. There are a few tests that you'll have to complete before I can sign you off. After that, you'll be able to explore the city. First things first, let's get you moving on two wheels. Hold the left stick to mount your bike. Follow my route through the cones. Keep the left stick held in the direction you want to cycle. The triggers operate your front and back brakes. Hold both to stop when you enter this box. Over to you. Let's go. Grey sedan, probably the most popular sedan in the world. On gray.
follow my route and keep inside the cones. 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 Cool. When you're mounting your bike, if you want to quickly turn around, Hold the left stick opposite the direction you're facing and double tap pedal. Over to you. Let's go. Hold the left stick opposite the direction you're facing and double tap pedal. Hold the left stick opposite the direction you're facing and double tap. Hold the left stick opposite the direction you're facing and double tap pedal. Hold the left stick opposite the direction you're facing and double tap pedal. Hold the left stick opposite the direction. Hold the left stick off. Cool. Okay, so it isn't rocket science so far. Things will get tricky soon enough. Don't get too cocky. Right, you look stable enough to take it up a gear. When moving, hold pedal to increase your target speed. If you keep the left stick held in the direction you want to move, you'll maintain this target speed, even if you let go of pedal. Over to you. Let's go. Cool. You're getting into the swing of things. If you tap pedal, you'll accelerate quicker than just holding it. But when you reach your top speed, you aren't going to go any faster. So give your thumb a rest. Hold the left stick in the direction you want to go. This will maintain your speed. Okay, let's practice some quick maneuvers. Let's get you skidding and jumping. Follow my route again, but use your back brake to skid around these tight corners. When you get to the corner, hold the right brake and move the left stick to control your skid. You can counter steer to control the direction you're skidding. This will help you maintain a skid for longer. To finish, jump over these boxes. Tap jump to bunny hop over the boxes as you race towards them. To get back up to speed quickly after skidding, try tapping pedal like we talked about.
Follow my route again, but use your back brake to skid around these tight corners. Tap jump to bunny hop over the boxes as you race towards them. Follow my route again, but use your back brake to skid around these tight corners. Tap jump to bunny hop over the boxes as you race towards them. Follow my route again, but use your back brake to skid around these tight corners. Tap jump to bunny hop over the boxes as you race towards them. Follow my route again, but use your back brake to skid around these tight corners. Tap jump to bunny hop over the boxes as you race towards them. Follow my route again, but use your back brake to skid around these tight corners. 